They say that what happens in Vegas stays in Vegas. But Eric and Shannon have ignored that famous saying. For it was, I'm told, at Gregory's bachelor party in Las Vegas, where Eric spotted Shannon, a beautiful girl in the same club, but who was there for a bachelorette party. Eric moving slowly, making sure that Shannon was the thoughtful, loyal, and compassionate partner he was seeking. Shannon loved that Eric was close with his family, had similar life goals, and enjoyed traveling, and of course, playing pickleball. Soon, Eric asked, so what are we exactly? They both knew what it was. so happy when Shannon started to bring Eric around. He provided some much needed male energy for my dad's girl dominated life. And he's also patient and level headed. There's a magnetism to him that makes you want to hang out and chat about the latest and greatest in your life. And Eric, you came into our lives and you, you fit into our family so well. I love the way that you looked at her that night at dinner, I feel like it's still the same way that you look at her today, and it's so special. And like all who know you, we are so proud of the man you have become. So good luck to you, Shannon. You're marrying a guy like none other. We all love you because you love my big brother. Shannon has always been an incredibly loyal friend. From the minute we met you, you've always made sure to make us both feel like we were equally your best friend. We really couldn't imagine life without you. As we've gotten older, moved away to different states, we're so grateful that when we can't always be together, Eric is the one that's with Shannon. In the presence of these witnesses, and in keeping with our tradition, you have spoken the words and performed the rites that unite your lives. Eric and Shannon, you are now husband and wife in the sight of God, the Jewish community, and all people. Everybody. How about Shannon and Eric? Eric, you share a special bond with me and mom. You were the first to give us the greatest job in the world, and that was to be a mother and father. Watching you grow up from that little mischievous boy and now it has brought you to be the loving and caring husband and soulmate that you are has been a labor of love for your mother and I. But to say that we feel blessed tonight is an understatement. There are really no other words to describe the feeling that we have. So I'm going to ask everybody to raise a glass. 
we wish you guys lots of love, laughter, happiness, and may all your dreams come true. We love you guys. I just wanted to say a quick thank you to all of you for being here. I know most of you had to travel, and thank you for being here for us and with our family, and it just it means everything to us. And we love you all so much, and we will never forget all the effort everyone put into making here tonight, so we appreciate it. That's it. Now let's party!